Hey everybody, welcome back to the wood shop. Today we're here to do a little test. That's right. Pretty soon we are going to outfit the shop with a whole shop dust collection system. For the past few years, um, we've been using a homemade device consisting of a shop vac and a couple of buckets and some hose, and it's worked pretty well for us but we have to move it between pieces of equipment. So it's not very handy in that aspect. But if you want to get started pretty cheaply with dust collection, click up here and check out that video. Uh, the other thing that we need to figure out is some air filtration for those fine dust particles. If you've ever seen me sanding, I get a little bit dusty. There's that fine dust that gets in the air and sticks all over everything. And so today, we're going to start thinking about building our own air filtration unit. We've seen other people build these online and a lot of them just use a simple box fan such as this one. So we thought we would go out and buy one and maybe do a little test and see how much suction we can actually get with this, see if we catch any dust in a filter. So we'll break out the table saw. We'll just take off a little blade widths at a time, see what it picks up. Let's make some sawdust. Now I'm going to attach the filter to the back side of the fan with a little bungee strap. Now this is a filter. filter. It's a basic, it's middle of the road style filter and you know it's not for really really fine particles. If we build something later on we'll probably get a lot better filters. But this will do for now just to test and see what we can catch in here. All right, we made some dust with the table saw, but I think an even better test to see if this is gonna pick up some fine dust is to do some sanding. Um, like I said, it can get a little cloudy in here sometimes uh, when we sand down a board. This is a cedar fence picket. It's a little bit rough. I'm gonna take some 60 grit to it and then uh, some 120. So we're going to turn on our uh, makeshift air filter and see how this works. We did some cutting, we did some sanding, and the air in here is not cloudy. At least at a close distance, this will pick up fine particles. That's right, and um, the biggest test for me was when I was sanding, my glasses did not get all like dusty. Usually, all of a sudden, I think it's super, super cloudy in here, and it is, not to say that it's not, usually. Um, there is a lot of dust in the air but a lot of the time it's just because it's collecting on my glasses and, and then I clean them off. And with this, they didn't get dusty at all. So I call that a win. We'll go ahead and draw up a design and try to figure out some way to make a filter box for this. I'm thinking about doing it maybe on a 45 and putting two filters on the front of it, something like that. I think that would work good because it would be pulling from, you know, like that from the front and the side both at the same time. 
If you want to make sure you catch that video, be sure to subscribe below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, you can also check us out on Facebook if you want to head over there, Woodsongs by Russell, and at woodsongsbyrussell.com. We thank you so much for joining us today. As always, happy woodworking.